movie Jaws. It's honestly such a masterpiece. It created such a real feeling of fear and terror to the point where many people have cited this very film as their realization they were afraid of sharks. And it's not hard to see why. I for one wouldn't want to get in this big fucking fish's way. Jesus fucking Christ! Well, you know how the old saying goes. It was a movie in the 80s. There's a game by LJN. Is the game fucking shitty? Well, probably. There's only one way to plan out. Let's pop this fucker in. Now, when you start the game, it's time to cast off and head out into the ocean. They give you no explanation as to why, but we all know it's to look for Jaws. Time to batten the hatches and full steam ahead! Right, Evan. Arr, me mateys! Now, while you're out at sea, uh oh, looks like we hit something. Time to go down and find out exactly what. After diving into the ocean, we find absolutely nothing. Just what the hell did we hit? All I see are jellyfish and stingrays. So that can only mean the game pretty much lied to us just to get us down here. You dick! And the downside is, once you get down into the water, there's no way to get back up on your ship. You're trapped. A prisoner. While you're scuba diving, make sure you don't touch anything. Because if you get hit by something just once, you're a goner. Ugh, this stupid game. After you kill enough enemies, it's back to your ship. And your objective now is to reach this other marina. But to do that, you need to have collected five shells. If you don't have them, they tell you to fuck off, and then you can't dock in their port. Wait a minute, is this supposed to be a marina? Or a hooker? Sadly, you'll have no choice but to head back out and try and kill more enemies, in hopes that they'll drop some shells for you. But let me make it perfectly clear that you still got the two main enemies to fight, and odds are you're gonna get bored pretty damn quick. Wow. I mean, wow. This game is boring. This game is just about as boring as going fishing. Uh, I'm not talking about real fishing. I'm talking about black bass fishing. Here's another game that just plain sucks straight monkey ass. The entire point of this game is to cast out your fishing lure in hopes that you find a fish. Now, every once in a while, a fish will come by, but then it just leaves as fast as it fucking came. Come on, come on. Yeah. Come on, fish. Fuck. This game is terrible. How is there a market for these shitty games? Get your eyes out there and do some real fishing. Well, you talking. Now, once you return to the marina with five shells to trade, they end up giving you a raider to track down Jaws. And I'm still baffled as to why this thing's even in the game. First off, Jaws pops up to the surface quite often, so it's not really that hard to find him. And if you insist on tracking Jaws with the radar, then be my guest. Just be prepared to head back into the water every five seconds to search for the invisible shit that keeps hitting your boat. Fuck! And the worst part is, they don't even give you the option to dive down or not. They actually force you into the water. I mean, face it. At this moment, you are this game's bitch. What if I don't want to dive into the ocean again? Or what if I always end up with a bad case of swimmer's ear? God, this game just flips my shit. In the game Silent Service, which I still think is the best submarine game out there, you go around and patrol the waters just like you do in Jaws. But they give you the option of either attacking or continuing on your merry way. Having that option in this game would have been a nice feature to have. Once you've gained a few levels, then it's time to complete your mission. What the hell is this? This is Jaws? How unimpressive is this? Jaws looks like a little shrinky dink when he should look something like this. Yeah, now that's more like it. Ah, but no matter. Time to take him down. Yeah! So after you fight Jaws for a little while, another shark decides to join the fight. But this one is much smaller and a lot faster. But that's okay because a few shots will take him out. Yeah! What the fuck? Why did my game just switch over to a bonus round? I was clearly having a final battle with Jaws. And I was also only three health bars away from winning. Just what the fuck is going on here? Well, it seems that by killing the smaller shark, it triggers a bonus level that interrupts your battle. Ugh. This game's getting to be goddamn ridiculous. So, 
Once you go back to fight Jaws again, it's time to drain his power completely. Now there's only one more thing left to do. Max put a spear right through his heart. Now this can be kind of tricky, and if you fuck up, you have to kill Jaws all over again. Alright, time to take his ass out. Yeah! This is for Jaws 2! And Jaws 3! And Superman 4! <laughs> Whoops. Okay, wait there. At last, Jaws is dead, and the ocean is saved once again. Well, until an Exxon tanker decides to drop by. Um, well, I can honestly say that this game is a masterpiece of shit. The only thing left to do is to destroy this fucking piece of shit! But that got good enough for this fucking game. Come with me! Piece of fucking shit! Piece of fucking shit! <laughs> oh, Josie! Oh, you did this just for me? <laughs> you look so unwell! <laughs> Oh, Josh. Oh, Josh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, my God. Get you nice and fucking covered. <laughs> <laughs> you the finger and it doesn't even matter. It doesn't even matter, Josh. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Josh, what did you make me do? What did you make me do? What did you do? <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, no. Oh, what's that smell? What's that smell, you stupid little piece of shit? You stupid motherfucker! So we can go home, buddy. So we can go home, Jaws. Well, I can honestly say that this game is a masterpiece of shit. <laughs> Don't laugh!